U.S. President Barack Obama has looked back at his accomplishments and spelled out what he hopes to achieve in his last two years in office. He used his State of the Union address to underscore his determination to stand up to terrorists and fight extremism. Fifteen years that dawned with terror touching our shores, that unfolded with a new generation fighting two long and costly wars, that saw a vicious recession spread across our nation and the world. It has been, and still is, a hard time for many. But tonight, we turn the page. Obama says his country has entered a new era with an economy that's growing and a deficit that's shrinking. He also spoke about pressing international issues. Obama suggested airstrikes against Islamic State fighters in Iraq and Syria have been a success. In Iraq and Syria, American leadership, including our military power, is stopping ISIL's advance. Instead of getting dragged into another ground war in the Middle East, we are leading a broad coalition, including Arab nations, to degrade and ultimately destroy this terrorist group. Obama called on Congress to pass a resolution to authorize the use of force against Islamic State militants. He said he wants to show the world that he and the members of Congress are united behind the mission to destroy the terrorist group. The president also expressed his desire to accelerate negotiations for the Trans-Pacific Partnership Free Trade Agreement. And he spoke about the U.S. policy shift on Cuba, saying the idea of containment was long past its expiration date.